Hi, this is Jeremy at 1LD, and this is a brief tutorial on how to use clean tabs uh, of the Rapid Weaver stack. Uh, version number is 1.0. I'm going to start by creating um, a stacks page, and then dragging the uh, clean tab stack in, into it. Automatically, by default, the stack will generate four tabs, so you can easily decrease the amount over here or increase it. Uh, with the limit of 12 tabs. Uh, you can also switch easily between theme designs. Um, the automatic design, I'll show you that real briefly in the preview mode. And just so it looks more like a page, I'm also going to turn uh, the sidebar on. And this is using the Carpe Diem theme, if you're interested. And as you can see also, the tabs are sized according to the text um, within them and not necessarily how they appear in the back end. So that's the um, default theme, theme 1. Theme 2 takes the tabs and detaches them uh, from the body of uh, the content area. And theme 3 contains them inside of it. So I'll show you Let's add some background color actually, just so we can give it a, a slight cream color. And also while I'm at it, let me just give us some default text just so we can see uh, this thing as it animates. And I'm actually, so we can see more of a transition, I'll add a little bit more text in this container and not much in this one and I'll just leave the fourth alone and let's demo it and so this is the uh, theme 3 where the content uh, area wraps around each tab and theme 2 uh, is where the content is actually separated and these are the three most popular ways I've seen the jQuery tabs used. And this is not to be confused with the jQuery UI tabs, but this is a uh, much much smaller jQuery script, uh, which I chose primarily for customization purposes and also for speed. Um, in the customization options, you can control uh, font sizes, uh, border radius, um, container width, if the containing area you would like to make the accordion less than the containing area, you can easily do that here. Uh, you can also switch the animation speed, which I'll put on fast so we can see that. Um, and also, just for the heck of it, I'm going to I'm gonna build kind of custom accordion that I, I thought was, um, was kind of nifty. So I'm going to turn the border radius up. I'm going to make the background the same as the theme's background so that it, it appears invisible. And then um, in the inactive tabs, I'm going to give them a darker color along with the border. I'm going to give that a darker color. And then the text, I'm going to make white so they stand out. And the hover text will just leave this nice blue here. And let's go look at that on a page. And so now you can't even actually see that it's in the clean accordion. Or you don't see a typical accordion uh, appearance though you still get the accordion effect which is pretty cool and you can use for, for some real nifty effects. Um, but really you have uh, complete control over all the customization which will allow you to uh, really fit this uh, in some creative ways to whatever theme you're using. Uh, you can also drag uh, other stacks into uh, these empty content areas uh, such as on the demo page I dragged an accordion section and, and you could pretty much drag just about any uh, inner element. Uh, so that ends it with clean tabs. Of course, as always, if you have any questions or would like more support, please visit our support page at onelittledesigner.com support. We have manuals, a blog, and also a context section.